going to demonstrate is a little bit of teaching puppies how to play fetch and tug. We all know that puppies have a lot of energy and we need productive ways to help them learn to relax in the house. One of the best ways that we can do that is by teaching them how to play with us. By teaching puppies how to retrieve their toys and how to play tug appropriately, it really helps reduce naughty puppy problems like destructive chewing and nipping and biting at our arms and feet. What I'm doing with Bandit right now is just playing gentle tug with him with the toy. When picking a toy to play with a puppy, you wanna make sure that it's soft and easy for them to grab and hold on to. As you can see, he's doing a little bit of dead dog puppy tug, which is super cute. What I'm gonna do now is encourage him to let go of the toy, which he just did as if I cued it. I did not. So now I'm gonna get him excited about it and toss it for him. Come on, Bandit, can you bring it back? What a good man! So he brought it back nice and close. I'm gonna tug with him back over. You'll notice I'm located. I've seated myself somewhere where he's naturally inclined to go and lay with his toys. It's super common for puppies to wanna to play keep away. But if you pick a spot that's a nice smaller space like we have here in Kelly's office, it helps prevent them from playing keep away with the toy. Now to get him to let go of this toy, I'm gonna make this toy boring by just kind of bracing it against my leg and show him the new toy. That's super exciting and encourage him to switch and then toss that toy away. So now we have a nice game of two toy fetch going on. Oh, what a good boy. And I'm gonna play with it, with him tugging away. <laughs> He's being super cute petting on him, but nothing too rough, nothing that's going to get him too amped up. Now I want him to switch. I'm going to show him this new, the different toy. Encourage him to let go of that one. Oh, you beat me to it. Oh, you ready? And now he's ready to go and retrieve the other toy. What a good boy! So this time he brought it a little closer, which is great. Playing two toy fetch and tug like this is a great way to help your puppies learn how to play fetch when they're adults and to burn off some of that puppy energy. You will also notice Toonie in the background demonstrating an advanced version of the place training that we talked about earlier in his videos. She completely understands how to stay in that chair and it's just a great example of how you can use place in everyday life. 